Hello, my name is Augie Jimenez. I'm an applications engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video shows how to create a derived mirrored part from existing geometry. We will then edit the newly created part from its own distinct feature design tree and then combine the new part to the original to have a single part file. In this case, I want to mirror this body to the right side of this face. To do this, we'll select the face, we'll go to insert, mirrored part. We want to break the link to the original part and we want to say OK. From here the first thing we want to do is save the part. So we'll go to save, save as. I'll save it to my desktop as right mirror. And now we can make our changes. If we go to the feature design tree, we see that it has its own tree with its own features. If we edit the features, let's say this chamfer for example, it would jump to the image of the original way it was created, which was the left hand side. Let's go ahead and make this 40. Let's make a change to this wizard hole. Let's make it 23. And let's make a change to this boss. Let's save our changes and let's jump back to the original. What we want to do from here is insert the part that we just created. So we'll go to insert, part, and since I have it open, I'll select it from here and I'll say OK. As you can tell, the part that we created has the changes we made. The chamfer is bigger, this boss is bigger, and this hole is bigger. You also notice in our solid bodies folder that we have two separate bodies now. To change this, we'll go to insert, features, combine. Our operation type will be add and our bodies to combine will be our two bodies. We'll say OK. And as you can see, now we have a single body and our solid bodies folder shows that we have a single body as well. This has been Augie Jimenez with Go Engineer. I hope you found this SolidWorks tutorial useful. If you would like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit our website.